Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to see about the Windows 11 operating system. Recently, on June 24th, Windows has unveiled their new upgrade. So that is the Windows 11 operating system. So from the Windows 10 OS, they are actually upgraded to the Windows 11. Well, in this video, we are going to see about the Windows 11 installation Q&A. So what are all the doubts you are having that I'm going to fulfill? So top five Q&As has been listed based on the Windows 11 uh, installation. And then how to install the Windows 11 operating system officially in your uh, system. And then finally, we are going to look over into the Windows 11 operating system, like its first look and it's an overview of the Windows 11 operating system. Well, firstly, on the Windows 11 installation Q&A, so the first uh, question is that whether the Windows 11 is cost or not. So the answer is it's completely free only in case if you are already using a Windows 10 operating system like that means or else if you are already using a Windows activated product means you can go ahead to upgrade the Windows 11 operating system. Now the next question is what happens to my earlier files? So the answer is nothing will be happened. So after the installation of the Windows 11 all your files will be there only. So there might be no issue with that and at the same time for the safer side in case if you're having very important files like that means better you can make a backup with your other portable storage but in most case nothing will be happened to files you are already having in the system now the next question is how much time it is actually takes to install the windows 11 os now the answer is completely depends upon the internet speed you have and then the system configuration you are having so in case you are having a very good internet speed and you are having a good configuration like means a good browser and a good ram and then a good uh, graphics card like that means you can fastly install the windows 11 os and at the same time it actually takes some time to install the windows 11 os and you will not get the windows 11 os on the first update itself so after installing some uh, two to three updates only you will get this windows 11 os now the next question is is there any additional storage required to install the windows 11 os means so for this question the answer is not that much so you will not require any extra storage to install the windows 11 os but for safer installation it required to have some amount of storage in your system then only the installation will be successfully completed and from the windows side also they have mentioned that so after the 10 days of the installation in case if uh, if windows has used some of the extra storage means that will be cleaned after 10 days of installation now the next question Question is whether my system is supported for Windows 11 installation or not so to check whether your system is supported for the Windows 11 installation or not so there is a dedicated page from the Microsoft Windows so from there you can able to find what are all the basic requirements need for the Windows 11 installation and similarly there is an app is also available so this is uh, so that is an official app from the Microsoft Windows so the app name is is called PC health app so I have given the link in the description below so just install the application in your system and after installing and just open that so after that you will get to know that whether your system is supported to install Windows 11 or not now the finally so how to install the Windows 11 operating system in your uh, system so actually the Windows 11 stable version is not yet available to any users because Windows 11 update stable version is still not yet rolled out so Microsoft announces that uh, soon the Windows 11 stable uh, version will be rolled out to one by one users but you can able to experience the Windows 11 preview version through a Windows Insider program yes so there is a Windows Insider program so using the Windows Insider program you can able to experience the Windows 11 preview version so to get the Windows 11 preview edition you have to join to the Windows Insider program and I have actually posted how to join Windows Insider program video so here is the icon so here you can able to find that video and in that video I have explained how to join in the Windows Insider program 
so here also i have explained some shortly so in case if you have any doubt so in that video i have clearly mentioned from uh, top to bottom about how to join in the windows insider program so now to experience a windows 11 so you have to go to the windows uh, insider program uh, option so in the system settings itself there is an option windows insider program and once go to that so there is an option get started and once get started and you have to uh, sign in with your microsoft account and after that uh, just select a channel so once you get started into the windows insider program you have to select a channel so that is actually three channels one is a dev channel that means a developer channel and then a beta channel and then a one more channel is actually available so in the three channels you have to select a dev channel developer channel once you are joined in the developer channel in the windows insider program so after joining so you will get a some uh, some one or two updates so after uh, just install one or two updates and it uh, and the system will actually multiple times uh, restarting and after doing all these things so finally you will get the windows 11 preview update so after installing that windows 11 preview update so you can able to experience the windows 11 operating system so this is not a stable version so this upgrade is not available for all the pupils so only the users joined in the windows insider program they only get this windows 11 operating system so this is how you can easily install the windows 11 operating system officially so you no need to download any of the iso files from, from the third party websites to install the windows 11 you can officially Officially install the Windows 11 operating system through a Windows Insider program. Well, now let's move on to the Windows 11 operating system and just to find out how it looks in its first look and its overview. Well guys now this is how the windows 11 operating system is actually looks like as you seen here the first look so here i have seen the major changes so generally in all the windows operating system the start button at the left side only but along with the start button all other icons are actually moved to the center of the taskbar and similarly you can also move the, all the icons back to the left side so there is an option for that also and uh, as you seen here so the uh, options are completely differs so the windows is actually what saying is that so this windows 11 operating system is almost similar to the windows 10 operating system so they are actually fulfilling that the same privacy and security as like a windows 10 in addition to that in this windows 11 operating system you will get a better design actually the look is uh, completely changed so as you seen here so the looks are completely changed and the designs are so good it's actually look rough refreshing in design so and the transition is also too good so i am just pressing the start button so just see the transition and its speed so it is uh, actually fastly opening and fastly closing and uh, like that uh, let's see the, the settings option so these are all the settings option so as you seen here so this is a system uh, setting option and all the system uh, on all the settings option as actually grouped so here is actually a complete change in the settings option like this all other options is also changed so in the file explorer so you will see some of the differences like uh, icons is actually previewing and the font style is actually changed and the font size is actually changed and uh, see the all the icons so it is actually giving some uh, new look and a refreshing design and uh, likewise uh, so whenever in the blank screen uh, we are often uh, choose the refresh option so by just right clicking we are always choosing the refresh option but in the windows 11 after right clicking you will not find the refresh option so to get the refresh option you have to go to the show more option and there only you will get the refresh option so generally always people will uh, just right click and then just click on the refresh always but in the windows 11 you can't able to do that and at the same time you can able to use the refresh option so after right clicking you have to go to the show more option and there you will find a refresh option so regarding this windows 11 operating system i have post a other video with its full features but this is the first look of the windows 11 operating system and the one more thing i have actually liked in this windows 11 operating system is that so it's uh, multitasking for example i am a file manager application on the chrome application 
you can easily able to partition these both application easily so here is a new option that is called uh, so after hovering your mouse in the maximize uh, button so you'll get uh, some like this uh, different layout so in case if i want to in the display i want to place this file manager the left side means so i have just tap this left side means uh, the file manager goes to the left side if uh, right side means it goes to the right side so i'm just tapping to the left side so the file manager is automatically adjusted and uh, move on to the left side and on the right side here is a chrome application and sometime in case of i want uh, one more file manager means so i can just select the one more file manager and just go over to the maximize button and just select this option so the next file manager is actually here and likewise i can easily uh, able to copy or uh, move from one storage to the other storage easily so just i have to drag the file from one area to another and the files will be easily copied so for multitasking it's actually super cool and uh, likewise the speed is also super good so in this windows 11 operating system you will get a better transition speed and all the icons and all the uh, basic designs are changed ultimately and as you see in the basic uh, as you see in the default wallpapers so these are the default wallpapers uh, windows is having so totally a uh, six wallpapers so this is uh, a light blue color wallpaper so this is how it actually looks like uh, so how do you like this wallpapers let me know in the comment section below and then this is the dark blue color uh, wallpaper and the designs are completely good so as you see in here so these are all the designs so completely a new design so that is a major highlight of this uh, windows 11 operating system so like that uh, we have uh, three more uh, different wallpapers so how do you guys like this uh, windows 11 operating system so this is the overall first look and here is also having a search option and there is in a one more uh, new option that is the so you can able to make a different desktop like uh, you can able to work at the different modes on each uh, desktop like you can choose this desktop as a office work and you can choose this desktop as a other uh, professional work like that so in this desktop you can uh, choose other application and uh, in this desktop you can uh, access uh, other application like that so like this uh, two different desktop you can able to choose and there is also a new widgets option is also available and here you can uh, able to manage some of the widgets too as per your personalization well guys now that's all about this video guys so in this video i have made a windows 11 installation q a so the, the the doubts you are having so that are all covered in the q a like session and after that how to install the windows 11 operating system officially via windows insider program and then finally we have a look into the windows 11 operating system so the first look and overview of the windows 11 operating system so we have seen how the windows 11 is actually looks like so i have really liked this windows 11 operating system because of its a new design and the design is actually looks very nice and it's completely new unique and refreshing so what are your guys thoughts about this windows 11 operating system and let me know in the comment section below and in case if you are already a user using the windows 11 operating system means so what your experience so so let me share your experience in the comment section below and that's all about this video guys and if you guys like this video hit the like button and if you guys like to watch my upcoming videos hit the subscribe button below and thanks for watching this video guys